Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Tonight I'm going to be showing you a different dinner meal. Um, I'm going to be making it for me and my fiance Ben. Um, I'm going to be making a variety of rolls. And this is the bowl we put the rice rolls in and you just add or you can you just add a bowl of water actually just to soak the rice rolls in and that's what I'm doing. So just bowl of water here. I might have to move the camera a bit so you guys can see me. Oh just move it. going to grab two bowls, actually three bowls. Yeah. Need that. No. Oops. 
So there's the avocado there. Um, I normally grab a knife or I grab a spoon to get the avocado out, but this one's very, very soft. So excuse my fingers. I'm just going to use my fingers to peel the avocado out. So done. One. Done. Me and my fiance Ben, we love avocado because with avocado, you can actually have a lot of healthy dishes. Um, not just rice paper rolls, you can make a lot of things with avocado, um, tuna, rice and corn, um, make a lot of things. Just I like avocado and toast sometimes, you can eat on toast. Um, basically anything. Avocado is done. I'm going to pop this in the bin, guys. Tuna. One bowl done. Now a can of corn. This one I'm okay with sometimes. I do break the can. Um, which I just did again. Not going well today, but <laughs> opening. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'll just <laughs> open it with a little butter knife again. Zero me. Oh, there we go. So we're gonna just oh, gross water. I like water in my corn. And then what I'm gonna do is get my water in the It's not washed yet, but I used it today 
and I think it should be okay because I did rinse it before I put the dishwasher. So it should be okay to Sometimes they do break. Fingers crossed it doesn't break. I'll just let them soak basically. Sometimes you have to add more water, it depends. But you basically let it soak in the water. Why that soaks? Can you use these plates? Let's um, let that soak a bit more. It's always good to use your fingers in there just to let it soak. Because you've got to let the whole thing soak in the water. Rice. See how it's all soaked? Still a bit. Just gonna soak it more. Then you just get it off out of there. Open it up, pop it on the towel. And while that is dry, well, you don't really need to dry it, you just use the towel. You add another rice in there. And then you just Add that, that, and then you dry this. Sorry about that, my partner. Let's talk about the cars and the motors and the chickens and the wings. Right, um, now. So we add the rice. I haven't had rice in these before, so bear with me. Rice. Corn. And avocado. Hang on, smart. Avocado. It's always good to have it your big chunks in there. there you go. Then wrap that up. So 
I got so you can see me what I'm doing. Strap that up. Just feel, feel that there. And then pen. Pen, I'm feel babe, I'm filming. Put it down. Sorry if you can hear in the background, guys. Now, just soak this, see that? It's all soaked, ready for the next one. So, we can add rice. You just want a plain one tonight, just rice corn and avocado. So I'm just going to add my rice. Add this one in. See that big cracked a bit there. I've got this cloth just in case to wipe my hands. Nice. Corn. And avocado. Avocado. And let's wrap it up. We have. Oops, sorry about the corn, it's just coming. And... So, Alright, this is. I'm just using one side of the towel now because there's corn and Rice on the other side, so. Do you want tuna too? Tuna, babe? Uh, yeah. Okay, so this one's gonna be rice, tuna, and corn.
my um, my sister, no, my brother's um, wife makes them, and they're really, really nice. And since I tried, I think I tried hers. I can't remember, but she makes them at home, and they are really delicious. She, I think she puts different ingredients in hers, but I um, thought, wait a minute, this would be a good dish to make for night time. A healthy dish so that's what I'm doing um, that's dry now so I'm gonna make him a tuna and corn and avocado now and might have to get another can of tuna for me and corn that's okay and some avocado, I think it's a clean, so just some thick avocado on top. And then I'm gonna roll that one up. I'm gonna show you the finish now of my fiance's, and then I will do mine. So. so that is my fiance's Ben dinner. He's got four um, rice paper rolls, two, actually three with rice, avocado and corn. Um, he's got a tuna, corn and avocado and then he has a rice, corn and tuna. So that is his dinner for tonight. Thank you babe. You're right. And now I've just got to make my dinner. So we need to get out of here. Well I've just got to finish filming. It's up to you. I won't be fit. I won't be long. But, um, so I will do my one now. Mine is tuna. So, uh, oh, mine broke. See what I mean by breaking? I make a mini one as well. <laughs> so that's okay. Um, so. This cloth was just wiping my hands, so it's not dirty at all. If you guys think I'm using a dirty cloth, and I'm not. Okay, so I'm going to add some tuna. Plus, I might have to get another can of tuna, but that's okay. Um, tuna. Some up corn. And... I'm going to use some chunks of avocado. Might use two chunks of avocado. Now I'm going to wrap it up. Get my plate. Put on top. Just going to grab another can of tuna. Got a different kind, but still the same. Do that again. It's really chunky avocado here. I mean, tuna, sorry. Avocado. But, okay. Why well, this one's a bit chunky? Right. Oh, I know then. Alright, that's enough. Now, this one is done. 
broken a bit, which it's lost half of it, but it is okay. I can still work with it. They do break because they are very, 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 very thin when they get into the water, if you can see, like that thin. But to not try not breaking it is always to go around the sides, which I found out is best. And then you just add it in the water, trying the best. Just the main thing. Right. So I'm going to add my tuna on this one. My corn. Oh, dropping corn on the floor. It's all good. So I'm just going to have tuna and corn on this one. An easier one. Okay. Oh, I just need to eat the corn. And then I've got a little one here. So I'm going to just have a little corn one. And then I'm going to... Um, got two more to make now. It didn't work. It's very, very cute, but it didn't work. Oh well. Mm. Okay. Making this one for me now. Last rice paper sheet. Hopefully, I don't break this one. There you go. Just drawing that one. I'm going to add tuna on this one and avocado. Tuna. Avocado. Chunky chunks of avocado. And just tuna and avocado for this one. And then I'm going to make a tuna, avocado and corn for the last one. What I'm going to do is mix it a bit because this is what we're going to use. I'm going to add the rest of my tuna in here. done myself a, a bowl right now because this is the last one. Just soaking it in there. Last one guys. Hope you liked this cooking show. As I said I'll be doing cooking shows every Saturday. Different ones. Now I'm going to add this ingredients in there. It's all mixed, so you can do this at home. Very easy meal. You can have it for lunch, dinner. Um, yeah, anything really. Very healthy. And now I'll wrap this one up. And I'll show you my one now. And there's my one. I'm going to end the cooking show with you guys tonight. If you like my cooking show, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I do shows Saturdays and Fridays at the moment. I will be back doing three days a week, but at the moment, two days a week. So, yeah, have a great weekend, and I'll see you next Friday. 
Um, and there'll be challenges happening too. So please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If I get to 300 subs this year, there will be a challenge with me and my fiance, Ben. Um, uh, the water bucket challenge will be happening. So yeah, if you want to see that, get to 300 subscribers and I will be doing that challenge. Thank you. Have a great weekend and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.